The street is bustling with people. A woman in a wheelchair is rushing towards a passerby with a knife in her hand. When she saw the face of the passerby, she realizes she's mistaken for someone else. The helpless police officers advised her to give up her revenge. But Lucy wouldn't give up so easily. She wanted to continue her investigation. Lucy found the surveillance records of the crime scene. The next day, Lucy and David came to the neighborhood to stake out. Then a man walked up to them. Lucy looked at him again and again, but she wasn't sure if he was the murderer. Suddenly, the man came over and stared at the car window. David and Lucy were scared to hold their breath. Luckily, there was a film on the window screen. The man did not find them. After he left, Lucy offered to go to his house to check it out. David helped to unlock the password. Lucy went in alone, seeing the walls covered with exquisite porcelain dolls. Lucy was shocked because she saw her daughter's necklace. This is the murderer's home. Lucy's eyes burst into tears, but the murderer returned suddenly. Luckily, David used his quick wits to come up with a